Welcome to news on Trelawney LJ. Please remember to subscribe and share. The Easter term for the Trelawney circuit is ongoing. Justice Bertram Morrison is presiding. There are 166 cases listed for the four-week duration of the circuit. Among them are 68 lottery scamming cases, 42 sexual offenses cases, and 28 murders. The 28 murders did not escape comments from Senior Deputy Director of Public Prosecution, Jeremy Taylor. He had this to say. What? Wickham McNeil, the losing candidate in the last general election in Western Westmoreland, is now slated to become the standard bearer for Trelawney Northern whenever the election is called. The 66-year-old McNeil's position for Northern Trelawney has not gone down well with senior politicians. Among them is Desmond Leakey. Are you craving some delicious, authentic Jamaican cuisine? Look no further than Vibes Pizza Fast Food, Entertainment and Lounge. Our signature Falmouth chicken dishes are sure to satisfy your taste buds, with options including chicken and fries, chicken with rice and peas, chicken pasta, chicken burger, and barbecue chicken. And don't forget to indulge in some sweet treats with Devon House's ice cream. But Vibes Pizza is more than just amazing food. We also offer entertainment throughout the week, including karaoke nights every Monday, live band Wednesdays, and a Yasu Nice Fridays. Entry is free, and we offer free parking too. Come sing your heart out or dance to the beat of the music while enjoying a great meal with friends and family. Visit us at our two convenient locations in Falmouth and Lucy, and experience why we are simply the best. Our Falmouth location is open from 7.30 a.m. until you say when, and our Lucy location is open from 10 a.m. until 11.30 p.m. Call us at 876-994-4863 or 876-805-7550 to make a reservation or place an order today. The welcoming sign for Falmouth to be constructed by T.P. Deco is now ongoing. Wade Mars, the director of T.P. Deco, said the work should complete within four to six months along the foreshore road entering Falmouth coming from the west. The Zion Community Action Group had its launch on Friday. Dale Evans, principal of Holland High, was the guest speaker. 
he encouraged the participants and members to look forward to good times. Those persons who set up illegal settlements at Cooper's Bend in Trelawney have ignored notices from the Trelawney Municipal Corporation to remove their houses. Superintendent of Police Winston Milton said these people face having their homes demolished before they live in because according to the superintendent once they live in them it will begin to be more problematic to have them removed. This has been Trelawney LJ News. Please remember to subscribe and share. Have a wonderful day.